Hello, this is Reverend Ken Wilcox, the Center for Spiritual Living here in St. Augustine, Florida. Today, I'm going to share a reading from my book that's coming out this month, Rays of Hope. Uh, it's a collection of affirmations that I wrote during the COVID uh, epidemic. And in it, I wrote, Our divine birthright is freedom and goodness. We have come to life so that we may experience the joy of living in fact, we are on a mission from spirit to give and receive love and compassion. It's what we've come to life to do, and it's ours to do. So join with me now in this affirmative prayer. I'm going to do it in the first person, but take it in for yourself. If I say something that works for you, hold tight to that. If I say something that doesn't work for you, well, just let that part slide by. But just know this truth with me today. There's but one God, one mind, and one power. And that power is perfect love. And that power has called me by name from stardust. So that I might be exactly where I am. So that I can experience the love, support, and compassion of God flowing through me. Calling me on to be the best part of myself the most courageous, the most loving, the most compassionate part of myself. I am here so I can witness God unfolding in my life in miraculous ways. I am here so that I can experience all the love and joy and creativity that God had in mind when it prayed me into existence. So here today, I cast off any shackles of fear, of doubt, of worry, of lack and limitation. Those are small ideas and I've played with them long enough. Here today, I lift my eyes up to a better knowing for myself, and I choose to see myself as God sees me, not as weak and wounded, but as strong and courageous, moving out into the world and making the world a better place for my having been in it. It's what God has called me today to do, and today I am saying yes to it. It's my truth. I celebrate this right knowing, and I release this prayer into the mind of God to do its good and perfect, bold and dynamic work, returning to me, multiplied abundantly. And together we say, and so it is. All right, my dear friends, let me leave you with one last thought. Your life, your life is not a problem to be solved. It's a miracle unfolding. Your job today and every day is to go name your miracle, to proclaim your miracle, and to make it your own. God bless us all. Now let us go be the miracle God has called us to be. This is Reverend Ginn. Until we meet again, many blessings.